What's up guys? I just want to say something really quick. My tank top pre-orders are live until Friday the 6th. Um, it, and you know what? I'm not ordering any extras this time, so you cannot buy them past the 6th. And it's a pre-order, so you got to get them in quick. That way I'll know how many to get because I'm not ordering literally any extras. If you want them, get them in now. They look so sick and you guys beg me for tank tops. So go cop them now. Prove me that you actually want them. I've already sold like I think five and it's been a day or something. Yeah, so we're doing really well guys. Let's get this to like, let's try to get like 20 of them sold. Tell your friends, share this, do everything. More importantly though, enjoy this video because there is a lot of motivation in it, a really good new physique update and just a whole bunch of stuff that I think you guys are gonna love. And here is a little preview. Look at that reflection. I think this is something every dude does. Look at their reflection in their freaking car window. All right, let's get this workout. Video, I called you, uh, Charlie and whatever, not Charlie. No, yeah, you, know, you called me Willy Wonka because yeah, I Willy had Wonka. those clout goggles, yeah. Oh. <laughs> you might as well be a team punisher. I'm trying to eat over You're here. not doing anything. I'm trying to eat. You're, you know what, me and Derek are hungry. <laughs> We're getting games, you're not. I'm hungry. <laughs> Uh, how, how, hey, how are you? Did you do arm before you came here? No. This is just how you know. No, Aaron. Oh, I see your new shirt too. I like that. See? That's sick. Hey, no, I did not do arms no. before I came in here. It's the shirt. Go ahead and say it. It's the shirt. Go ahead. Don't comment on any of the Instagram stuff because I guess he's real sensitive about that. I don't comment what? on it. I give hey, him a like. Don't don't, don't, don't like person. him either. Don't like him either. <laughs> he's real sensitive. I'm gonna get sensitive when you like him. I get sensitive when you say like. I said, I, I, I didn't even get sensitive. You know why I didn't get sensitive? I just let you know, Colin ain't nothing below, bro. I, you work I put, at my home gym. I'm gonna tell you why I didn't get sensitive. Cause you don't like anything, and you like that. Picture. I put respect at the yeah. end of it. No, but what you put at the beginning of it? I said at the end of it, I put respect. <laughs> <laughs> no, it was like, check this out. It was the sarcastic. It was like, still haven't, still haven't seen that shirt I gave you. <laughs> Hashtag respect. You know. <laughs> The whole reason I'm even recording right now is because I told him someday if I'm rich and famous or whatever, if that happens, I have to pimp out his truck. Let me get you, uh, help me out, man. What do you need help with? Pimp his truck. Pimp your truck pimp out? Truck. You need some, to pimp out scooter. You're already ahead of me. You got, oh, you need me video? Yes, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm the videographer. Oh, yeah. Kyle. Okay, anyways, you uh, wanted see, this. I had to get a Millennium Club member shirt. I had to promise here, you. ever. Because I'm a team punch. Exactly. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Kyle, what's today's date? <laughs> July 1st, 2018. July 1st, 2018. This is Sunday, obviously. <laughs> Hot Pocket Sunday. Uh-huh. And I, what did I promise you? You said, well, uh, when you make it big, you know, when you got lots of money, you know, YouTube famous, mm -hmm. you know, world famous, that you're going to call me up, mm -hmm. you're going to pimp my truck out. Or, if you don't already, or, I have to yeah. buy you a brand new truck. Yeah, or you have to buy me a brand new truck. Mm -hmm. So, you know, if my truck's too old, because I didn't, you know, make it and get big. Mm -hmm and I can't afford a new truck anymore. <laughs> he's gonna give me a new one, or he's gonna pimp the one out that I have. Yeah, so I'm I have about to. My day. You got, yeah, I will, I'm, I'm dead serious about this too. Like, you guys don't believe me, this is, it's, it's not in writing, but it's video proof. I have to pimp his truck out. Don't, don't delete that video. I can't, I won't. Oh, okay, okay. Well, I mean, I can delete it, but I won't. How long do you think it's gonna take me, 10 years? To, to come home and be like, Kyle, it's time for the truck. Aren't you on a two-year whatever plan? Two years? No, you're two years to do your real estate thing. And yeah, I got it. I would say like five. Five? Yeah. Okay, we're going to put this on a five to eight year redemption plan, okay? Okay, okay. so in five to eight years, I'm probably going to be making a something about... Because I always see like those videos, it's like, oh, it buying my dad video. a car or whatever. Yeah. What do I even say? A pay it forward video. You're paying it forward. Yeah, I'll do a pay it forward video for Kyle. And then I'm gonna go to McDonald's, order something, <laughs> and I'm gonna pay for the person behind me in the truck that did that, Yeah, that's what you can do. <laughs> All right, well, if any of the swim managers are watching this, Kyle was the best one. All right. Oh, yeah. Check it, note it. <laughs>
issue of Physique Update. Let's get it. Not a stop, why shit don't never stop. serious note I can't even talk today I'm getting a new microphone and a rig for this camera so the audio is gonna be like amazing it comes in tomorrow so you're gonna see this video and everything and I only reason I'm putting this video out today is because I just feel like people need some motivation and need some just that oomph to work and oh, today was one of those days for me my phone freaking died a piece of crap Died at 51%. It's just like, what? Come on, bro. Come on, Steve Jobs. You can design stuff better than that. No, RIP, but for real. Listen, if you are having one of those days where just nothing is going right, nothing is good for you today, and no one is treating you the way you deserve, blah, 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 everything in possible way that could go wrong is going wrong, I had one of those days yesterday. And you know what I did about it? I didn't complain, I didn't blame it on anyone, and I, I didn't just sit there and feel bad about it. I got up, I looked the world right in the face and said, I'm not going to be beat by this crap today. And that sounds so cheesy to the people who aren't going through it, but the people who are going through a bad day, a bad week, even a bad year sometimes, need to know that it's okay. Even the best of the best people, like freaking Dwayne Johnson has bad days. Kobe Bryant has bad, bad days. Name anyone, they have bad days, but they do not let it get the best of them, okay? And just like I didn't let it get the best of me yesterday, all you have to do is look the world back in the eyes and say, this is my dream, this is my life, and I am in charge of it, okay? I'm not gonna let one person take this day and throw it away. I'm not gonna let my job distract me from my dream. I'm not going to let anyone stand in my way because the only person who deserves to stand in the way of my dreams is me. That's the only person that really stands in the way of my dreams is me, okay? So if you need this just push, this motivation, you haven't gone to the gym today, you've given up, you've convinced yourself, I'll just make it a rest today, that's fine. Don't do that. You're cheating yourself. You're the one standing in the way. Don't blame it on anyone. The, the literal obstacle between you and your dreams is you, okay? And I can't stress that enough. There are so many people that I see day in and day out make excuses, point their fingers, blame anything under the face of the sun except them. They never really stop and think and say, hey, I'm the reason that I'm not successful. I'm the reason I don't want to look the way, I, that I don't look the way I want to. I am the reason that I'm not as financially successful as I want to be. I'm the reason, I'm the reason, I'm the reason. And you need to stop being the reason that you're not successful because you know what? You are the reason that you can be successful. And just because you've had a bad day, week, month, or year, doesn't mean that you cannot get up and come back and make that lost year worth it. 
okay? The bad times do have one benefit, and I can tell you this from personal experiences. The bad times have a benefit. You know what it is? You find yourself. Sometimes it only takes a day. Sometimes only a few days. Sometimes a week. But for most of us, it's a long, long process to find your identity and on top of that, find your dream. Okay? And I can't, I can't stress enough. I literally cannot tell you enough how important it is to chase it. Okay? And if you're cringing at this point, just dislike, click out of the video. I don't even care. But the people who are here listening to me say this. If you do not chase your dream now, when are you going to chase it? Have you convinced yourself that, oh, I'll chase it when I'm ready? <laughs> when I'm ready. <laughs> You're never going to be ready. You're never going to be ready to chase your dreams. Ever. Ever. So get up and go do something now. I don't even care. Like, if your dream is to be famous, post something right now. Go do a photo shoot right now. You have the resources. You're just making excuses. Okay? And I'm not yelling at you and being mad at you. I'm trying to help you realize that what you want is right in front of you. You just have to extend your freaking reach. Just go. Just chase it, dude. Just like, I mean it. I'm in here yelling in this freaking echoey room, making it sound like one of those motivational speeches. Because that's what I want to be, a motivational speaker, okay? By making this video, I'm building one step to the staircase that leads to my dreams, okay? I am doing my part, and part of the Deek Army, part of this family that I have going here, is to help you do your part. You can do your part. We can all be successful. And you know what? Fitness, just because it's my dream, doesn't mean it has to be your dream. Doesn't mean that you want to look like a freaking bodybuilder. Maybe you just want to be in shape. That's awesome, get in shape. But figure out what your real dream is. That's all I'm like, I know this, I went on a rant for like five minutes straight now, and I apologize. But at the same time, no, I don't apologize. I'm not sorry, you guys need to hear this stuff because if you're not motivated and you're not chasing things, what is the point? Do something today. I don't care if you're watching this video one, two, three, six o'clock in the morning. I'm about to go to sleep or I'm about to do this. I'm about to do that. Okay, you need sleep. I get that. But when you wake up, set that freaking reminder on your phone that today I might have work. I might have to do this. I might have to do that. But after I get my priorities out of the way, I am not going to rest. Okay, because everyone has chores, everyone has a job, everyone has things that they have to do. And if you don't, and you still aren't chasing your dreams, that's a red flag right there. But everybody, most of my friends, they have jobs with strenuous hours. They have to do what's work at home. They have families that they have to take care of. They have real life things that they have to do. Does that just mean you can't chase your dreams? Because you have to take care of your family first? Because you have to go to work? Because you, no excuse is good enough. Okay? No excuse is good enough to just put your dreams on hold. I get it. You have to take care of your family. You have to go to work. You have to get things done. But are you just going to let off the gas when you're done? When you get off work, are you just going to go home, kick your shoes off, and sit back? Or... Are you gonna do what the very, very few people in this world do? And keep working, even when no one says you have to, even when everyone says that you're an idiot for going too far, you're an idiot for doing this. Oh, you know, I've heard so many things about me. And they all make me smile. <laughs> a lot of bad things, but more importantly, a lot of good things. And that's what, that is your choice right there. You can focus on the bad things people say about you, give up, and give them what they want. Or you can focus, you can focus on the very few people that might be supporting you. And if no one is supporting you, I will, okay? You got one. I support you. Chase it. Go for it. I don't care what it is. You got me. Message me. If you really need, like, I'm here. 
I want to do that. I, anybody who says, oh, Derek doesn't care about his fans, blah, 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 blah. I don't, first of all, I don't even like calling them fans. They're family. Message me. I might not get back to you in like that, like just quick, but I'll get to you. I promise, if this is a matter of you just need to be motivated, then all you gotta do is look at yourself. Because that's the best motivator. Anyway, guys, I'm done with this speech. Um, I hope you enjoyed this video today. And um, if you're still here watching, <laughs> I'm doing a little self promo here. I got tanks and my tank top pre-orders are live. They're live for only a week, so they will be available until Friday after the 4th of July. So the 4th is Wednesday, so they'll be available until the 6th. After that, I'm not ordering anymore. That's like, I'm not ordering extras. If you want it, you have to pre-order it because I'm not getting any extras. And if you know me, like personally, like you can just walk up to me and give me cash. That's great too. I'll put you on the list and get you your tank. But if you don't live near me, you don't see me face to face and stuff, you're just going to have to like get that pre-order because I'm signing the tanks and everything. They look awesome. They, they have a little motivational thing on the back that says it's all in your head because it is all in your head. It's all a mental state, okay? That's what I just preached to you about for 10 minutes. Literally, just like, I'm not kidding. Cop the tanks, be motivated, do something for your dreams today, and just go for it. Step forward. I never want you to say something like, I was better back when I was better previously. No, 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 no. That's, that's not cool. You need to be moving forward, forward, forward. Keep going, okay? You guys know I love you. If you are new to my channel and you are still here watching this, I'm Derek Martin, the All Natural Bodybuilder. And if you're a returning subscriber, I got you, as always, and I will see you in the next video. Peace.